grader with a 10-inch steak knife attacked another student today, all in front of classmates and teachers. As we first told you at noon today, police in Pitt County school officials say that frightening ordeal happened just as the day was starting at Aiden Middle School. The victim is a sixth grader in the hospital with stab wounds tonight. Ken Heineck is live outside of Aiden Middle School and talk with a student who saw it all. Ken? Police say an eighth grade girl got up from her classroom, entered a nearby sixth grade classroom, and then uh, that's when police say she stabbed uh, another sixth grader as other people watched in horror. Sixth grader Christopher Lee sits on his porch Friday afternoon. Just a few hours earlier, he was sitting in an Aiden Middle School classroom where his friend was stabbed. We heard a scream that was screaming real loud like an ow. Police say the 15-year-old victim was stabbed multiple times with a 10-inch steak knife just before 8 a.m. this morning. I'm scared, like, terribly, and I was hoping if there was something I could have done. He's pretty upset as it is, and I'm pretty upset about it myself. And it's those expected feelings from students that have school officials keeping a crisis team available. They are there um, on hand to talk with the students that are in the class that witnessed this, talk to other students at the school who may have known these students involved. Like Leaf, whose stepfather says he doesn't feel like his stepson is safe anymore. I'm thinking about sending him off to another school as it stands. There's just too many problems in the schools nowadays. But for now, little Christopher can only hope his friend recovers. Now the victim who is also in sixth grade but 15 years old is said to be in good condition tonight. Now uh, the, the suspect remains in juvenile custody in Pitt County. Now coming up tonight at 11, we'll have an exclusive interview with the suspect's mother. Back to you, Christine. All right, that's our Ken Heinick reporting live for us tonight in Pitt County. Well, just last month, it was J.H. Rose in Greenville where authorities were responding to violence. Three girls were arrested for fighting at the school. That same day at Rose, a female student was arrested for assault charges. Two school resource officers and a teacher were injured. Statistics show overall Pitt County schools see anywhere from three to five assaults with weapons a year. So how safe is Aiden Middle School? We researched the state report on school violence, and during the past five years, there were no reported assaults with a weapon. But we did find out that last year, Aiden Middle School had the second highest number of students found in possession of a weapon in Pitt County. That number was 13.